Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I love when I can come bearing what I consider to be good news. Something that is uplifting, that may be encouraging to the community. Something that I think we should embrace at least on its head, on the surface, before otherwise proven wrong. Uh, we of course have a new round of arenas this weekend. It's a couple of real interesting champs. Sunspot is older but still uh, beloved. It, when people ask me, Prof, who's a champion that you think has kind of now fallen under the radar because he's not used as much as he used to be, Sunspot would be on that list for me. Sunspot, heck, Blade can be on this Captain Marvel movie. Champions that you'd still get excited to land on, but then how many people use them daily compared to the better champions of their class? Omega Sentinel is a champion that a lot of people use right now, and where the game is... And the meta of the game and where it's going, as people always like to say, I think Omega Sentinel will have even more uh, utility as the game evolves. She will evolve like a fine wine, similar to the discussion on the channel last night of one of the best OG champions. Or, uh, not OGs in like 2015, but OGs in one of the first few years, and that's Hyperion, who feels like he's been around forever and is still killing it. Uh, so, completed arenas. We had Titania getting... A lot of the attention but Elsa is somebody that in the basic arena a lot of people love and I believe she is uh, one of the most underappreciated champions that uh, that we can see in the contest well the belief was that the cutoff would be about where the first round was, which was just under 34 million. That will get you six star Elsa, which was already amazing data because uh, that puts Elsa, especially with Battlegrounds now activated and uh, a highly competitive featured six star arena, that puts it in a position where you know you're just happier to to hopefully get scores lowered. Well. Um, the second round of Elsa scores came in, and I gotta give a shout out on Twitter. I'm about to darken the screen as we go to Twitter because I was tagged in a update somewhat recently from Hollywood Shono. This summoner got Elsa place 60. So, part of the good news is that when there is a new featured champion, even if they're not prestige uh, worthy like Titania uh, isn't, you're still going to have, if there's a basic six star, a really good chance, especially if you've got a roster that's Paragon, but even Thronebreaker, to compete for that six star. And as the game evolves, I really do think for all the attention that the six star featured arena gets, the six star basic is kind of the hidden gem of effort, of efficiency. So we have place 60, and check this out. Place 60 at 34.46 million. That was 40 spots clear. So there's a good chance that part of the good news of this video is that round number two for Elsa was actually even lower than round number one. And so as I darken the screen to look for any other data, you know, I think the bottom line is it is very, very encouraging to uh, have as much um, attention to detail as possible with the six star basic. And I know that uh, when it comes to arenas, a lot of people just, they just turn their brain off. It's the most mind-numbing, boring, soul-sucking work you can do in the game. And I'm not going to deny any of that, because I gave my arena God's soul submission years ago. But at the same time, like Elsa is a champion that you can get for a lot less work than you could. And I know it's the six-star basic, so six stars are worth the same amount of points as five stars, though they're still having a higher PI, especially those rank fours, than any of your five stars. But in general, that's my my preaching suggestion. If you want to get a six star in the basic and you have the timing line up, your 
time will be rewarded, whereas the featured, especially somebody like Titania, uh, is still going to be a tough ask to to go for. So there you go, YouTube. Thanks again to uh, someone that tagged me on Twitter, and I think this is really good news for the basic grind as we continue to see scores slowly drop as more summoners are spending their time in battlegrounds and elsewhere because act eight also dropped so you know time management in this game you only do one thing at once and it's interesting to see what takes a back seat to other things in this case i think the six star basic arena got a little help with that